Rockets are one of the most amazing human creations ever, but how do these rockets help us to touch the moon? So let's learn how rockets can touch the skies. This is a simple rocket model from which we will learn how liquid propellant rockets work. It has a two-cylinder, one contains an oxidizer and another one contains fuel. A couple of turbo pumps to pump fuel and oxidizer to the combustion chamber. A combustion chamber for burning fuel and oxidizer, a fuel injector to spray the fuel and the oxidizer in the combustion chamber, an igniter to burn the mixture of fuel and oxidizer, and the nozzle for controlling the amount of pressure and gas released. Both fuel and oxidizer are pumped into the fuel injector which then sprays the fuel and oxidizer evenly in the combustion chamber. The igniter produces a spark which burns the mixture and gases at very high pressure and temperature are formed which are then allowed to expand through the nozzle section. The gases at very high pressure and temperature are converted into kinetic energy, so the gases coming from the nozzle are at very high velocity, providing enough thrust for the rocket to move forward. Advantages of Liquid Propellant Rockets 1. Liquid propellant rockets allow precise adjustment of thrust levels, crucial for tasks like orbital maneuvers. 2. Liquid propellant rockets offer greater efficiency, specific impulse, compared to solid propellants, aiding in achieving orbital velocities. 3. Liquid rocket engines can be shut down and restarted, providing mission flexibility for multiple maneuvers or rendezvous. 4. Liquid propellants provide higher energy density, allowing rockets to carry more energy in a given volume, suitable for heavier payloads or higher velocities. 5. Liquid propellant rockets enable precise control over velocity and trajectory, essential for accurate orbital insertions. The biggest disadvantage of liquid fuels is that the need for pumps, piping, and separate storage for the fuel and oxidant means that extra mass has to be carried by the launch vehicle.